Uh, so I wasn't sure at first exactly what it was. Uh, I deduced that it was a centipede, but I wasn't sure if it was a millipede or a centipede. And now that I've looked up pictures uh, on the internet, I can distinguish that I saw a centipede in my house. Uh, it's not that big a deal, but it's kind of something that bothers me. It was in my living room, on the wall, uh, behind um, my LP uh, rack, uh, wooden rack, Victorian server, and I could see this thing, and it was, you know, it was three inches at least long, but definitely no more than four. Uh, it had antennae and, you know, prongs on the back, and uh, I didn't have anything to kill it with. I, I had a paper towel, but uh, I got paranoid because uh, some centipedes uh, are poisonous or, you know, can bite and it really hurts. So I just flicked it off with that. And my dad was there and I tell him, stomp on the fucking thing. And he's, well, he's old. He's like 73. So he's like slowly walking towards it. And I'm just like, that's not good enough. You gotta move faster. We need it dead now. Anyway, my room is right next to the living room, so basically it crawled its way around the left side and into my room. So of course I'm paranoid about it. I saw it and it went under a clump of uh, dust bunnies and just dust and it seemed to disappear. Now what had happened was there's a very small gap uh, where the the bottom of the wall doesn't quite connect with the floor so obviously what had happened is it crawled into the wall and is now somewhere in my wall which is not making me comfortable one little bit because I don't think they're like earwigs even though I'm not really sure if earwigs crawl into your ears or not or anything like that but uh, I wanted that thing dead I didn't want it around uh, it was it's it's perturbed me uh, I should have just taken the chance when I had that Kleenex and killed it myself, but uh, I didn't want to get stung, I didn't want to get pronged or bitten or anything like that, so I didn't do it. Because my dad was just moving too slow. And, you know, that's uh, it's a little bit creepy. I mean, this is a new house. I, I don't know if it's just the area I live in where these sort of bugs and creatures uh, are around anyway. I'm not sure if that's the only one. It probably is. But the fact is, I didn't get it. And neither did my dad. So, you know, probably be sleeping with one eye open tonight. Uh, not that that'll do any good. I don't think that thing's going to come around again. But I, w I would have preferred that it had been taken care of. Because... Uh, I don't like icky, crawly things, centipedes, millipedes, spiders, ants, anything. I don't like any of those things. Well, I'm, I'm less inclined to not like ants because ants, you know, ants are kind of cool. But uh, I don't like centipedes. I, I don't like them. And last place I saw that damn thing was in my room or in the hallway that uh, connects to my room. It's next to the uh, master washroom and it connects into my room so I'm probably just you know being a bit of a fairy about it I mean whatever it crawled into the wall it's probably gone now but uh, if I wake up and this thing's on the end of my nose and it's gone ah! then we got problem I, I don't like that uh, so that being said if I see it again, or see any of his, his siblings or whatever, I'm going to get him. Because I'm not having something like that slithering around in my house unchecked. Uh, I had read online that you should call pest control in such instance. Uh, I don't think that's entirely necessary at this point. It's probably not much to be worried about, but... Uh, probably no worse than a silverfish or something, but uh, you still don't want them around. Uh, it's getting cold. 
Uh, it's nearing winter, so would probably as he's looking for a warm place to stay for the winter. Um, although I, I don't know, I'm no insect expert, but I just go. I wish my dad had been a little faster, because if I'd been wearing shoes, that thing would have been dead. But I didn't have the opportunity, so that didn't happen. He got away. Uh, should be fine though. I'm just watching Inherent Vice. Um, that's uh, like about when I saw it was when I started watching Inherent Vice. I just turned to my left, and there it is on the wall, crawling around. I don't know exactly what he can do with his prongs, but I'm sure he could do some damage, you know, at least give you a good snip. I had watched uh, Man vs. Wild where he was talking about, well, it was a giant red one, but he said it was like being jammed with a red hot poker. So, uh, I wasn't going to test the waters on that one. Uh, even though this one was Tiddler by comparison, uh, I happen to know that uh, centipedes are. Uh, carnivorous, uh, vicious hunters. Uh, although this one is quite small, uh, the bigger ones are, in particular, uh, quite, quite vicious creatures. So I'm gonna keep my eye out for it. And if I see it, I will post an update of it. Uh, if it's dead bug body, well, they don't call them bugs; they're anthropods. Uh, body under my shoe or whatever I'm gonna get them you know how many mosquitoes I've gotten this year like a hundred I'm not even joking I you know I considered it a light year for mosquitoes there weren't too many around but I, I got a good hundred of them uh, some of their bodies are still plastered to the walls and things like that because I haven't been bothered to clean them uh, I like to think of it as uh, leaving a warning sign for the rest of the mosquitoes that are around but I don't think it works too well and it just looks ugly so I, I really ought to clean them I clean most of them it's just there's some in awkward angles that are um, a bit bothersome to get to but I'll, I'll get to it so anyway that's the centipede thing going on right now I'm gonna be um, a little bit paranoid for that for a little while uh, hopefully I see it and I stomp it out even if it wasn't the exact same one, but I thought it was the same one, that would give me some comfort. But, I don't know. I'd prefer it was the exact same one. I'd prefer it was the only one, but I don't know that. So, uh... I'll keep my eyes out for it. And if I see it, it's dead. I swear to God, it's dead. I'm gonna squash it like an insect under a newspaper. I'm gonna get it. Anyway, yeah, this is my video about centipede. Uh, talk to you guys later. See ya.